What is going on, everybody? Oh my god, I can sing. No, I'm just kidding. That was kind of kind of weird. Uh, that's a new intro I'm going to be doing every time now. I'm just kidding, guys. But in this video, everybody, we are playing Call of Duty Advanced Warfare, playing some more pubs. Oh my god, so exciting. I know. Like, I'm freaking pumped. I know y'all are pumped to watch me play some pubs. Like, what? Okay, this isn't going to be the video. What the video is going to be about, mainly guys, obviously I'm playing some Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. But, you know, I just feel like talking today. I just feel like talking. So, as I talk, I'm going to try to multitask here. But anyways, what I'm going to be talking about today is about, I don't know, about life. Like, what, like, what's the purpose of life? What's, like, your goal in life, like, in your mind? Uh, what other people may think about you, uh, just random thoughts that may be in your mind as anyone else's mind that's watching this video other than me, and I don't know, I just felt like talking, so I'm gonna be rambling about a bunch of, bunch of stuff, but, uh, anyways, everybody, pretty much, um, for those who don't really know much about me, I'm gonna go ahead and give you some, uh, info about me. I am 23 years old, and... I am, I used to be a baseball player, when I say a baseball player, I started when I was three years old, and some of y'all can argue that because how can you start at three years old, like there's not even a league or anything, like not even t-ball at three, it's like, t-ball starts like at four, four or five, but uh, I say three just because uh, I was out in the backyard, I have videos and whatnot of me and who it, my dad or my mom or whatever it was, uh, working with me, throwing the baseball and things like that. Well, um, anyways, I've always been really, really, really into sports when it comes to basketball, baseball, and football growing up. Anyways, my, uh, I was really good at, again, I'm not co being cocky or anything like that, guys, so I don't think I'm, um, like, that type of person, I guess. But, uh, I was really good at baseball. That was my main sport. Basketball and football, I was, I was pretty decent at. Um, I got hurt in football one day, uh... I say hurt. I, I didn't like break anything. I like rolled my ankle or sprained it. I did something to it. I can't really remember exactly what, but it was enough for me to. Uh, that was in middle school, and that was enough for me to be like, okay, I don't feel like playing football anymore. I'm stupid basketball and baseball. So, uh, anyways, long story short, guys, I'm gonna be rambling forever about this. Um, if the, those who didn't know, I played 18 years of baseball. Two, year, two of those years were college baseball. Those two years of college baseball was at a local community college um, that I got a I got a full ride scholarship. I got 100% of my scholarship paid. 100% scholarship of uh, like baseball. Like all my school was paid for. I didn't have to pay for nothing if it was for school. Um, but yeah, anyways, I, I played two years at that community college, and then at the end of that two year, I got invited to go play at Baylor University. For an all-star game, and I pitched there, or whatever, for that uh, for that weekend and all sort of stuff. And then I got a 75% scholarship to go to a university over in Arkansas. Well, I accepted it, and I decided to uh, about a week or two before school started. I called the coach and told him I don't really feel like playing. I'm going to take a break from baseball because I've been playing for you know a long ass time and just you know, just needed a break. So, anyways, I did that. Uh, so. Yeah, I did that and got a job, and that's where I'm at now. I'm just I work I'm working, and I feel like I should be doing something else besides what I'm doing there. Like I've always had a passion for video games, um, baseball, well sports in that matter, but I, baseball because I just love for I love baseball. I was a pitcher. Um, I I consistently threw about 88 consistent like 80, 87 to 88. Top topping out uh, about 92, 93 every now and then. Um, but I don't know where I'm going with this, with this now. I'm just like talking about random stuff. But uh, yeah, so I played baseball. Um, I got this job I'm, I'm at now. What else? What else about me? Um, oh, okay. So starting in July and January of 2016, I am gonna go. Be, I'm going to go back to school, back to college and do something that I want to do with my life instead of just working a job that I wake up every morning like a nine to five job type of thing wake up every morning you're like oh my god another day of work you know like the way I look at it guys in my opinion the way everybody should look at it 
you only get one life. Like, period. One life. Um, of course, you know, there, there's a huge debate. There could be a debate on what's after, you know, you die and whatnot, things like that. I'm not going to get into that. You know, you have your own beliefs. Um, but you only have one life. Like, the way I'm looking at it, you may live the life that you're right, mentally guys. wanting to live. Like, you go, when you have dreams, you wake up and you're like, oh, no, god dang, I wish I was real, you know, like, I want to be doing that, or this, or that, like, you should, you should go for that, like, you, nobody should tell you otherwise at all, like, I don't care who it is, if it's your parents, like, bringing you down, your best friend, like, anybody at all, like, you can do whatever you want it, want to do, like, th like if you really think about it, you really could, like, if you had the mentality and the drive, to, to do something that you really, 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 really wanted to do, you could do it. If you want to be a professional athlete, if you wanted to be a, like a scientist, a computer nerd, a, pro, a professional a gamer, YouTuber, like whatever it is, you could, like you have the ability, uh, that's probably sounded really stupid the way I said that, but uh, you have the ability to, to do that. Like you can do that. Like no one, no one can tell you no. Like they can say no, you're, you're not going to do that, but like who are they to tell you that you can't do something like that you want to do with your life as far as like making something better of yourself like if that was the case and people never went after what they really wanted to do in life then we wouldn't have like all these athletes and we wouldn't have like scientists to figure out like all this technology and like all these like really really tough like situations that you just are mind blown about because people are doing like we wouldn't have none of that because people would just be like oh well uh, I don't Okay, I guess I won't do it, you know, like, you don't want to have that mentality in life, you only live once, YOLO, that sounded really stupid, but it's the truth, Drake went lying, okay, he went lying, but, uh, but yeah, just go out and whatever it is you want to do, just put 110% in whatever it is, and I'm, gonna, I'm just going to talk about sports in general, or just me, okay, t talk about me, okay, so I... My whole goal in life when I was growing up was to become a professional baseball player. Okay? Like, that was it. There was nothing else. Nothing else mattered. I'm talking about, like, I was in school, went to school, and I was, like, averaging, like, C's. Occasionally get B's, you know? I wasn't a felon student, okay? Um, college was, like, a, was like, like a C, okay? And when I say C, I mean pretty much a barely a C. I was barely making C's. Um, but... Oh, my mind's going blank. I'm like getting losing track over here. But uh, but anyway, yeah, back, back to baseball or whatever. But we're back to me in general. Just uh, hold on. God dang, I can't even talk right now, guys. Uh, my second passion was gaming. Okay, I really love gaming. I never stopped gaming. Okay, I stopped baseball um, about a couple years ago. I stopped playing or whatever. Um, I really love it. I really love baseball with everything I have. It's like the most, like, one true thing I actually love, you know? Um, but gaming, on, on the other hand, is like another thing that I love to do. Just because I like, I like the way it makes me think. It's like a, it's like strategic type of thing. You like, I like outthinking other, other people. Um, so that's that. I love, you know, games my second passion or whatever. So that's what I'm doing now. And I'm going to go back to college for computer technology, uh, like, digital digitally like creating animations uh, working on computers whatever it may be but I'm also going to be doing YouTube and streaming on the side as well and trying to get that built up as well just because I love doing that and that's like one of the passions that I love to do so pretty much what I'm saying guys like baseball was my passion and it's, I still love it I still watch it my favorite baseball team is the Cardinals but um, even though I kind of gave that up I still have my one of my other passions that I, I love to do, and that's, and that's gaming. I'm going to continue to do that. I'm 23 years old. People can make fun of me or whatever it may be, but they, they may be making fun of me because they're not living the life they want to do because they're waking up, going to a 9-to-5 job every Monday through Friday, whatever it may be, a routine, just every day the same exact thing, and it just gets really dull and really boring, and in the back of their mind, they're not doing what they actually want to do. Like, if you're telling me you want to be a, a worker at wherever I'm just, it's just, just an example like not hating on anything or anybody if you love your job you love your job but like if you want to be like be like a McDonald's worker or like if you want to I don't know work at a tax return place I, I, I don't know like then 
I don't, it, it, you know, then do that if that makes you happy. But like, so, most majority of people who do that aren't happy because in the back of their mind they're wanting to do something else. Further, just, like in their dreams, they're going to sleep. They're just like, oh my god, I want to do this, but I gotta do this, this, and this. I oh, maybe I'm not gonna do it. Like, things aren't gonna be easy in life, and things aren't gonna be handed to you guys. You gotta work for it. Like, really work for it. Someone's just not gonna come up and hand you a ticket and say, hey, go turn this in, and you're gonna be what you want to be. Being an athlete, being a, you know, if you want to be a teacher, you got to strive for it. You got to, you know, if you're in a college and your job requires that degree, then you need to be in college or whatever it is and be 100% dedicated to that and really strive to get that. Because in the, in the end, guys, I promise you, it's going to be worth it. Like when I say in the end, like at the end of your career, of or your end of your journey through like school or your hard work dedication in the gym uh, to be an athlete be whatever it is like it's going to be 110 percent worth it and never let like, like always remember money is just an object okay guys like, money is just an object like whenever you die it's not gonna get buried with you unless that's like something you want but you know, it's going to be gone, you know, it's going to be passed down, whatever it may be, but like, like money, it, at the end, it's not going to really make you happy, like do, if you, ask yourself this question, guys, if you did not have, if, if you did not have, like, any money, money was not an object at all, you didn't even, like, it didn't even exist, okay, what would you want to do with your life, like, what would you want to do with your career, if money was not an object, like, you can do anything at all, like the only way to master something is to continuously do it and those who master that are going to be successful one day could possibly be, be successful if that's book writing like imagine imagine people writing books okay doesn't like just imagine someone doing that for a living and they're not getting paid off of it until one day like something like something happens because they're they're practicing their work they're practicing with their writing and eventually they're going to master their what they're what they love to do and eventually it, it's going to turn into something freaking huge you know like you just, i don't know guys this is there's so much stuff in my, in my mind that is i just like talking about but i just like to be positive like that and try to like tell like the i don't know tell people to just never give up on what they want to do because you, you, you'll regret it like if you really love something you'll you'll know in the back of your head that i want to do that and it sucks that I didn't, you know, it's going to be, it's going to, I don't know, it's going to feel, feel bad if you don't go for it. So, like, just do it, get it over with, and you'll be 100,000% more happier. Don't let no one tell you otherwise. Do you, only you, chase your dream, be unique, it doesn't matter, black, white, Asian, Japanese, whatever it is. Just do what you feel right, like in your heart and your stomach, whatever you're feeling, wherever it's at. Just do you, okay? That's pretty much all I want to talk about. I can go on and on and on, but I'm just rambling now. You're probably getting tired. It's like 12, 13 minutes in the video. But, uh, but yeah, I hope you all enjoyed the video. It's kind of different. Just try to take in what I said and try to understand it, I guess, the best way y'all can. And just uh, be as positive as possible and be... Be the best as you can be and never give up, guys. Thanks for watching. Hope you all enjoyed the video. If I did, give it a thumbs up. Uh, comment whatever you all want to uh, comment about. If you want to talk about anything, whatever it may be. But uh, And subscribe as well. That would mean so much. But thank you all so much for watching. And that's going to do it for today's video. Until next time, I'll see you all later. Peace.